morning and welcome. I woke up this morning and I thought to myself, you should film. So here we are. I'm starting off with some coffee. As every day should. But my name is Denise, in case you've not been here before, in case we haven't met, welcome. It's good to have you here. Um, today I'm not really doing a whole lot. I'm just kind of, so far, lounging around. Um, fed the animals and now I'm gonna do what I do, which is nothing. I'm just gonna throw my hair up real quick and put my contacts in. Um, Cause after I work on the computer, I'm probably going to do some yoga. Guys, if you cut your hair off, which I tend to do every time I have a midlife crisis, Make sure you don't cut it sh short, so short that it doesn't fit into a ponytail anymore because it'll ruin your life. Trust me, it'll ruin your life. <clears throat> I can't seem to get out of my sweatpants yet today. I mean, for real, is there even a reason to? No. So, okay. I am getting to that time of year where I need to go to the eye doctor and have them tell me, you're old, you need bifocal. And oh my gosh, nobody cares. So I'm gonna stop talking about that right now. Golly, I look like I haven't slept in a month. Okay, so let's get to know each other a little bit um, and I can tell you what you'll be spending time doing with me. Uh, so, I really love construction and I really love interior design. I'm not gonna say I'm the best at it and I'm not gonna say that I um, am a professional. It's certainly not what I do for work uh, and you might not like my style and that's fine. But if we're gonna hang out together, uh, you should know that you're gonna see a lot of my little house uh, it's a 600 square foot cabin in the woods, which is exactly where I belong. Um, and I am going to spend a lot of my time showing you guys the projects that I do um, inside, outside. I've pretty much got an idea for absolutely every space in the house. And as you can probably tell, uh, one of the projects that's going on right now is the staining of the walls. So the ceiling that you can see there is a uh, natural pine tongue and groove and that's what the entire interior of the house was when we bought it so it's absolutely beautiful but at the same time it's not quite what i want it to be so we are changing the color to kind of like a um a gray ish kind of like a whitish gray that but is still transparent so it lets a lot of the natural brown come through and then that way it kind of will bring everything together. So the trim around the windows is in an, is natural alder. Uh, we've got the pine beam that I plan on leaving in its natural state. But basically, but then we have the cream colored kitchen. So it was kind of, it's kind of the way to bring everything together. So you're gonna see a lot of that. Um, I still need to do the ceiling. I still need to replace out the recessed lighting, but all of that, um, is part of the plans for the like living room kitchen area. You guys, as I look outside, the snow is really starting to come down now, which makes me so happy. We are so overdue for it. Um, and it's so beautiful and it's just finally starting to cover the ground, cover the trees a little bit. Um, if we get enough of it, I will show it to you because it's gorgeous. And those are the reasons that I live in the woods in a mountainous terrain so that I can have a crap ton of snow. Hi, Yeti. Covered in snow, buddy? Huh? You happy about it too? Why is Rowan outside the fence? Huh? Why are you outside the fence? How many times are we gonna do this? Get in here. Does anybody want to adopt a great deer niece? Because this one right here, rather enjoys jumping the fence. So we have to fix that. 
that one is pretty much the best dog you'll ever see. Hi, buddy. So, meet Yeti and Roan. Tell everyone hello, buddy. Say we're gonna get to be great friends. Say my name's Roan and I am the 18 month old bad dog. Okay, can we just, can we just enjoy the snow for a few minutes? Look at that. These are the reasons I live in the mountains. These are the reasons I live in the woods because it's absolutely beautiful and it makes me extremely happy. Okay, so I'm just going to end the vlog here because no one probably cares what I have to do for the rest of the day. Oh, and I just saw my dog running outside the fence, which means he climbed over it yet again. So I will catch you guys um, on another day. Thanks for joining me and I hope to see you soon.